Hey guys, what's up? Hope you're doing awesome. So if I ask you what's the best video editing software that you can use to edit videos, then what comes into your mind? Is it Adobe Premiere Pro? Is it uh, Filmora? Or is it Aftercard? In my opinion, the best video editing software that you can use to edit any video is DaVinci Resolve. It's simply because DaVinci Resolve can offer you a lot of video editing capabilities that even Adobe Premiere Pro cannot. The best part about DaVinci Resolve is the color grading. The color grading of DaVinci Resolve is the best in the market. Even some of the professional Hollywood filmmakers use DaVinci Resolve to edit their movies. So today I'll be using DaVinci Resolve on my G15 and I'll edit my previous video on G15 where I was playing Cyberpunk. So I'll show you all of my editing workflow and I'll even render that video on this G15. So in that process, you can get a clear idea of the rendering capabilities of this G15 on DaVinci Resolve. So as you can see, I have plugged my G15 and it is at turbo. So we'll see how does this performs at turbo. But let's start a new project. Uh, let's say uh, untitled project 4 it's okay and let's import my previous clips on cyberpunk uh, now i'll just share with you my entire workflow so firstly what i do is uh, i just cut out the unnecessary portions in my videos which i don't want uh, in the video and i'll just make the video clean and then i'll shift to the transitions where i want the transitions in the beginning or at the end and then I switch to some effects like color grading and some other stuff if I want some titles in the videos and stuff like that. So first I'll just cut out the unnecessary portions and for that process I'll just speed up this video. So I have edited the first part of this video where I was just introducing the uh, motivation behind the video and now I want to import my actual clip of the gameplay and uh, it's 49 minutes long so I'll just import it somewhere here media pool uh, let's import it right here and then I'll import it again uh, maybe here but first let's widen widen this up so what i want is i want uh, this gameplay to be just behind the introduction part and then uh, i'll just put in the outro put some transitions so that the video looks smooth uh, so uh, what i'll do I just first uh, apply the transition at the starting of the video so if this is the starting then uh, I'll just go to my effects library and I maybe just an edited dissolve or a blur dissolve let's add a blur dissolve so I just add it up here and it I don't want the it to be so long so I'll just uh, take this end and just drag it somewhere like here so it becomes a bit faster like this and it's okay and here maybe where the cut is like there is this cut I'll use a smooth cut maybe so let's see if how does it look so maybe like this I'll use a smooth cut so it depends upon the duration that how smooth does the transition looks so uh, I just add these transitions so that the video looks a bit smoother this video is about 1 hour 26 minutes 21 seconds long and select YouTube uh, let's say this uh, test video unplugged all right uh, download is all right add to render queue uh, let's delete this and then I'll just select render all so Let's see how long does the G15 takes when it's unplugged.
So it took 5 minutes 50 seconds for G15 to render this video without the charger attached. Let's see how does it performs if you attach the charger rendering it at turbo mode. So in turbo mode, G15 took 5 minutes 42 seconds. So uh, it's just a difference of 8 seconds in performance mode and in turbo mode. So 8 seconds is alright. All in all, this G15 can easily take DaVinci Resolve and it can edit 4K videos. This video was a full HD video and if you are going to render a 4K video, then it's of course going to take a longer time. So that brings us to the end of this video and I want to thank you for sparing some minutes from your super busy life to watch my videos but in my analytics I have seen a lot of you who are watching my videos you are not subscribed. So if you can subscribe to this channel it would be a great favor for me that way you can get all these videos in your notifications. So thanks for watching guys subscribe keep watching I'll see you in the next video.